Yeah, I don't like the fact that I can't use my mirrors. I don't I don't like that. I got I need to sort my settings out. So but we'll probably go for about another half an hour or so I reckon. Go till about about half ten. And uh you, you, you probably will see some changes by the time but when I stream again next because it's um I've been playing this off camera. I've been chilling out playing this this map so it won't be a like a continuous progression you won't see. I also need to check to see if I've got hired workers to buy seed or not. Right, well the pigs need wheat or barley, so that's what we're going to plant. We'll plant some... We'll leave it on what it is, we'll plant some wheat. So that's another thing, this this cedar is the one you start with in-game. So it does actually start with some seed in it. So, not much considering the size of these fields. Right, now, I need to do these two runs up here actually, so we'll do these ourselves. Um, yeah. Well, what I'll probably do is I will probably end up buying two of these, probably. I think. Right, let's... Um, Wait, it'll be fine. But yeah, I should have got the horse. I should have got the horse seat, though, I think. But yeah, the hired worker follows the contours of the... Or maybe not, actually. when we come down to doing any weeding or anything like that I mean can you imagine it's gonna take us forever Right, so we're just going to do do a couple of runs down here and then we're going to set the hard worker off, I think. Because we need to empty the combines again. And do another corn run. And a soybean run. Need to go and collect some more grass. I've got so much in these doing. I have definitely took on too much for just myself. I could probably take this save game and put it straight onto my server. That might not be a bad idea. I don't know how it would run on the server, mind. 
because it has got a lot of adjustments to it. Right. Um, I'd better do another run upwards, I think. Because I think it's going to work better if I do it that way. Do you know what? Let's see. Let's see how far out this guy's going to go if I set him off. Right, how bad are you going to be, dude? Right, we'll leave him to it, see how he gets on. That's exactly what you've done with yours. Great minds and all that, you know. We'll leave that there, actually. Um... Cab corn. <laughs> um, which in game corn header fits then, Gav? Does the Capello fit? Because that was only thirty eight grand. That's an 8 metre, that's 12, that's almost... Or is it the New Holland one? They must all fit each other, surely, it's just a colour thing. Surely. It must, they must all fit. Yeah, and it's just down to colour or um, power, surely. I've got to look into that in the next stream, get a bigger, a bigger header. Set that off there. There we go, right. And um, there we go. <laughs> right, so what do we do here? So we now, this needs to go into the second pigsty, I think. I think there's a way out over here as well. Correction. I hope there's a way out over here. The rhythm will drive round, it's fine. Yeah, look, way out, told you. Nothing to see there, it's absolutely fine, don't know what you're on about. Really? Really? Just really? Look! Loads of room! Road rage much? 
Right, let's go and dump this in the in with the pigs. It's very difficult to play this one, this map realistically. Very difficult. It's nice, isn't it, Paul? It is nice. It's a very, very nice JCB. It really is. I don't think I am ever going to get on top of these pigs. I think they're always going to. I'm always going to be on the back foot. Always. Unless I may. Uh, I might have to buy another. Another two harvesters probably. But then you can't. You know, you can only cart for as much as, as you can with one person. This map is hard by yourself. It really is. But I think do you know what I may do that. I may do that tomorrow. I might I might take this save out of here and put it on the server save and then just do a start uh, do this one again from New Farmer or something. I was going to say, I could do a GD experiment on it, but that means keeping the base equipment. Don't know if I like that on this, on this map. See, they're getting dirty again already. Right, we did corn in the first one, so it's definitely corn in the second one now. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I'm I'm surprised. I mean, it's not you know, the the wear and tear, you don't notice it much. Um but it did surprise me when they brought that in because I was led to believe that there wouldn't be anything like that because the brands, like for instance like John Deere themselves, they wouldn't want a game where their tractors looked crap. Not to put the finer word on it. Later Farmer Dan. You know, so and uh so it surprised me that there was any kind of wear and tear or anything like that actually in the game. Right, so you can get going again. There's not much, li there's, there's a fair bit to do actually on this field. I can see myself being busy off camera later. Or tomorrow, actually, that'll be now, I think. Right, so what we are going to do, we are going to leave those two harvesters running. I'll turn that off. And we are going to grab the John Deere, I think. That is just, I mean, look, that's the colour of a John Deere. That's not the colour of a John Deere. That's the colour of a John Deere? That's not. That is? That's not. It wasn't until I put it in game I realised how off that green was. But that is just a coon reskin. I just wanted something different, but that'll be coming off the server. Uh, that'll come be coming off the game, so. Um 
Depends what you mean by a, a gain. I've broke it quite a bit. Right, so we've got... I've got some grass. I want to go and collect... Um, because we've got, yeah, I'll just show you this, um, this silo I've got over here while I've got this trailer on. I'm not sure you can, what you can actually put in it, but you can, well, well while the pipe is up straight like that, you can unload into here. Um, so if we just drop the pipe down. So we've got grass in there already, which I which I've been filling up. We can put straw in, and it looks like we can actually put silage in as well. Um, because I don't know grass and straw. I didn't know whether they made silage to have, to, so we can take silage out. But that's probably not as that is. But so, we, but we've got quite a bit in there. But I do need, as we've got the cows and that, we are going to need some silage. So we're going to do some grass silage. And. Um, we're going to go and collect a couple of trailers of grass and we're going to use one of the clamps down at the BGA. I was going to put a clamp here up at the farm but we're so close to the BGA it just didn't seem worth it. Uh, you got uh, ATS on Steam. Somebody gifted it to you. Nice. It's always nice when that happens. ATS is a nice game. I was very surprised with the um, the multiplayer in ATS. It's a lot better than it is on ETS. <laughs> Hell of a lot better. <laughs> Good old Google, Paul. Get whatever you want through Google, I tell you. Yeah, is that the 20, no, 100th anniversary? No, 25th anniversary? Something like that, anyway. Uh, where did I get the silage pits with shed? Oh, God. Um, what, where I've got the gra the, the grey? The grass, that's a cross between hay and grass, obviously. Um, they came with a map, actually. Um, I think they're on the the Z map, which I can't pronounce. Is it the Zweistenhof or something? But, um, yeah, at the minute they're just being used for storage, that's all. But, yeah, if you, that's a modding welt pack, pack, that's where them sheds come from. Um, but they're actually in the map. Um, I think it's Zweistenhof, I think. Um, Google that and that'll bring the map up. That's a very, very nice map as well. Do I play ATS? I have done in the past. Um, ATS and ETS is definitely something that's better off played um, in MP, definitely. So, um, single player in them is fine, but I do tend to I like to um, talk to chat and uh, you can't really do that um, in single player. There's a lot of concentration in, in ETS. Excuse me. It's 
So I have still haven't decided yet whether I'm streaming tomorrow night or not. I should be. Um, but um, Thursdays is a day where if I want to stream I will, if I don't I don't. So Mondays, Wednesdays and Saturdays are my three stream days um, per week. And I like to do I like to do a good two hour recording if I can. That way I get four episodes onto the channel, which is nice. And um I'm hoping um I'm hoping Sutton Farm the first load will be coming out uh, very very soon hopefully. Right, so we must be getting up to being quite full here. Yep, very nearly. That'll do. That's as near as damn it. Like I said, I did, I did think about... putting the um, putting a clamp on the farm but the BGA is literally the other side of the road I could probably set up a row of conveyor belts to get it back to the farm fairly easily if I wanted to, that could be quite interesting. How many conveyor belts would you need to go from the BGA to the farm? Ah, you got to go over the road. That could cause a problem. We have to turn traffic off. <laughs> <laughs> 